Hey everybody, Dr. Wessel Couch here with another Math and Minecraft episode. Today, we're gonna do something truly epic. You know what the first letter of epic is? It's E. That's right, we're approximating E in Minecraft, the highly anticipated episode. Just so we're all on the same page, let me explain to you about the number E. E, also known as Euler's number, is one of the most well-known mathematical constants. Formally, E is equal to the limit as n goes to infinity of 1 plus 1 over n, all raised to the n. To five decimal places, the value of E is 2.71828. For today's episode, we need to consider the Taylor series for the function e to the x, which is given by e to the x is equal to 1 plus x over 1 factorial plus x squared over 2 factorial plus x to the third over 3 factorial and so forth. We could rewrite this as e to the x is equal to the sum from k equals 0 to infinity of x to the k over k factorial. And when we evaluate at x equals negative 1, we get 1 over e is equal to the sum from k equals 0 to infinity of negative 1 to the k over k factorial. Remember that. We'll see it again. Now let me fly over to my Blackboard studio so I can talk to you about derangements. A derangement is an ordering of the numbers 1 through n such that for all k, k does not appear in position k. So for example, 2, 4, 1, 3 is a derangement, but 2, 4, 3, 1 is not because 3 is in position 3. You'll learn in combinatorics that the number of derangements is counted by the sum from k equals 0 to n of negative 1 to the k times n factorial over k factorial. The total number of orderings of the numbers 1 through n is n factorial. These orderings are called permutations. So if we divide the number of derangements by n factorial, we see the probability that a random permutation is a derangement is the sum from k equals 0 to n of negative 1 to the k over k factorial. Does this look familiar? This is approximately 1 over e. So we're going to use this sum with n equals 9 to approximate 1 over e. Let me explain how we're going to do this in Minecraft. We have nine different colored blocks in the dropper. These would represent the numbers one through nine. Each time through, they get sent out in a random order. That makes a permutation. I made a machine that checks if green comes out first, then gray, then magenta, and so on. If any color comes out in the position that I set, we do not have a derangement. Here magenta came out third, so it's in this chest. The machine keeps track of the number of non-derangements and the total number of permutations. So I'm going to let the machine run overnight and let it do its magic. One thing to note though, is it plays some weird music and the cats kind of go crazy around it. I'm sorry you had to watch that. 
All right, let's see how we did. The machine cycled through 647 times, and 409 of those were not derangements. So 238 out of 647 were derangements. Taking the reciprocal, that gives our approximation of E as 2.71849. That is awesome. I can't believe our approximation was so good. Anyway, I had a lot of fun making this video. Let me know in the comments if you have any ideas for some future videos. I always love hearing from you. And please share this video with your friend. It will really help me grow my channel. Alright, make sure you smash the like button before you get out of here. Bye bye.